the surgeon patient ratio is even worse. It's almost one, almost to 200,000. Now, because of that, and also the distribution of, of, of these highly qualified persons, it's largely in the urban areas. So the rural poor have no access to quality surgical services. Secondly, the average cost of an operation is put at around 1.5 million. Again, the poor cannot afford it. So we mobilize the resources on behalf of the poor. So for instance, if we do a thousand operations, that's already 1.5 billion money that would have saved. So even if we inject 300 million or 200 million or 500 million, still you have saved over a billion shillings. So you are taking the skills of the people, you are taking off the surgical burden, the cost of surgery uh, from them. So we need to move out of our way and also prepare the other districts that are not here. So I will expect the RCC to reach out to the other, other RCCs, the, uh, the mayor to reach out to the other chairpersons of uh, the local government, the town clerk to reach out to the cows really and tell them that there is a surgical camp that will take place.